now we're gonna do another mission. Great, where they left off. Why does the helicopter move faster when it's not being piloted? How much does Danny weigh? God damn. For some reason, he's still smaller than Skyrim cities. Someone from Libertad that rescued our people. Really? Someone from Libertad? Slow ass game. They hated us. I heard Yelena is working with them now. What's happening? Meeting on the mound. Some of our friends want to quit early. Okay, listen up. This isn't worth killing for. Sure as hell isn't worth dying for. We're young. We should be out there drinking and fucking and skipping school. Woo! Our parents and this grandparents already stole our future. Why should we give a shit? That's what I used to think. 
And then one day, Admiral Benitez walked into my classroom with a gun. She called on your name, you came to the front. One by one. Alvarez. Bermudez. Carrillo. The Admiral read their so crimes. Stupid. Protesting, handing out pamphlets, liking a Clara Garcia post. Fernandez, Jimenez, Peña. I learned a lesson on my last day at school. You can either be on the right side of history or the wrong side of Castillo's guns. Wise words, young Guerrilla. La Moral taking new members? Defense? What? Is there an age limit? I will plead for La Moral. If you take me. That's fucking cringe. Welcome to the war, viejo. <laughs> so how do we take out the Admiral? Push-ups are the first step to victory. The Grand Hotel, Danny. That's the key. I got a convoy I like to make friends with. No. We need Carlito. Push-ups never lie. You just cut your hand open. You sure doing push-ups was such a good idea? What can I say? Your little speech puffed me up. See! Si! The part where you put the gun to your head and pull the trigger? That was crazy! I loved it! <laughs> then... There's these farmers in Sombreado Gorge. They're super fans of La Moral. Actually, they're super fans of me. They were part of my fan club when I was on the national team. They tipped us off to this special convoy that op don't know about you, but Jeez, I like, fucking what? love hearing convoys. Not even. Would you do me a favor? Spain. I am Gilberto Rosario, bachelor, performer, spy master for la revolución. Come see me when you're ready, honey. Oh, okay. I like these young areas. They remind me of well, me. Only smaller. And it's going to take a lot more than a... Castillo has many bullets. I need you to go to the Grand Hotel Caballero. It used to be a resort for wealthy touristas, but Benitez converted it into some sort of prison torture. Benitez can't find out where we are, Danny. We need to talk. We got El Tigre on our side. What good is that old man going to be for La Moral? Did you sleep during this That was so You just got to control the fire. say when you're in her chair you either give up information or your life or both I'm going to have to find you go quickly our scouts are already in position and ready to help you heard Yelena earlier that was the voice we needed sometimes it's hard to tell if we're winning or losing you know we're going to win this thing I promise you that I remember right when these trucks back into life Let's 
2022. God damn, I can't believe that was two years ago. Walks away. This cat, this oh, cat is reminding me of you. some huge hotel on a mountain. It looks fancy. Looks like the place isn't taking reservations. When Castillo's there, it's always checkout time. How long are we doing this? I don't know. My jokes have no vacancy. <laughs> I'm hanging up now. Danny, I'm your eyes on this one and I'm in position. The dentist is already in there with them. Binga. I thought dentists were always late. Not this one. No way that's supposed to get. Check it my right. Now tell me, Hugo, where is La Moral's headquarters? Fuck you, hija de puta! This is dead. La moral is safe. That's fucking great news, Lani. Oh, and I'm working on a gift for Gracia. Gift? She was going to hotel. Kill me for sure. I'm taking it. They've tortured their last guerrilla here. You sure you know La Moral, Lani? I'm just saying it. Come <laughs>
What do you want the people of Yara to know about the conflict? <laughs> conflict? It's business as usual. Look, in spite of all the rumors going around, there's no war. At least not here in Eastern Yara. Am I right, Admiral? This is not a war. There. The criminals of La Libertad will be stopped. Yeah. They're few, we are many. You hear that? And... Libertards? This means chica. She means business. And what about the violent gang known as La Moral? Anyone who attacks Yara's military or a business interest is not a true Yaran. My strategy... And I helped her with the strategy. I've got decades of experience. I ran a security firm. The East is safe. Am I right? Right. No prea capas, por nada. That's a cut. I gotta go. Señor Presidente. Admiral, so lovely to hear your voice. If I could ask, how is it that a group of school children in El Este are inflicting the highest number of active duty casualties of this war? Admiral? They, um, they have support from Libertad and the Legends. I've always taken a personal interest in your career. Hand picked you out of the Academy. But make no mistake, there were more experienced, more qualified, and more intelligent officers in line before you. You stood out for one simple reason. Si, señor presidente. You were a woman in uniform. And now you could be the highest ranking woman ever to have her head on a pike. Gracias, señor presidente. Hi. Hi. What the? What's up? 